Hello and welcome to MachineCon 2023. This is the fourth edition of what is considered to be India's largest gathering of AI and data science leaders. And the AI 100 Awards is all set to happen today. Lots of exciting things are lined up. Before all of that, let's go meet a few leaders and talk to them. My first question to you is, what job do you think will be easily replaceable by AI? Anywhere where low skill requirements are there, salesmanship, customer service. I think in the future, marketing. Because that's the only thing I can answer, yeah. Do you work in marketing? Yes. <laughs> I think a lot of the basic photo editing. Photo editing. <laughs> I have two images here with me. One is AI generated and one is hand drawn. So we're going to go around and ask people if they can find out which is which. So. Which one do you think is AI generated and which one is uh, hand drawn? This is hand drawn. This is hand drawn and this is? This is Well, you know what? This is AI generated and this is hand drawn. Left is AI generated. Well, you know what? You've got it wrong. <laughs> this is AI generated and this is hand drawn. Team Chat GPT or Team Bard? Uh, see, I haven't used Bard to be very honest. Chat GPT? If, if I'm, my question is more about current information, I would go for part. Otherwise, you know, I would uh, probably you know, stick to creative writing, I would probably stick to Chat GPT. Right now, Chat GPT seems to have the lead, but I'm pretty sure Bard will catch up. And do you think AI engineers and data scientists make a huge salary, like really good salary? I gotta do it, man. No, they are like any other any other tech or engineering person. So I think relatively they are better compensated. I'm not sure about that. AI and data science and data engineering, they're very good careers to start off in uh, because you do get paid more than the average Joe. Do you think uh, AI can ever fall in love with humans? Yes. Yeah, they can. So it'll soon to happen. So it'll be boon for married people. Okay. Okay. <laughs> AI better fall in love with uh, the humans because of the fact that uh, if if uh, apps like Tinder and all have to succeed in the going forward, it better fall in love with its subjects and its customers, right? What is he doing? He's beginning to believe. Do you think uh, AI can fall in love with human? Um, I don't think. Like you know, at this point. The emotion is something I don't think it might take a long while for AI to be able to replicate. 